Good morning, good morning, good morning. It is the morning of day one, the beginner's class, and I'm super excited. It is like 10 of 8. I should be leaving here in approximately 15 minutes. Get there approximately 8.30 and get ready to set up. Now, one thing is, I got another notification about 7 a.m. Another young, another one of my young ladies missed her flight. So she will miss like half of the class. Um, But guess what? We're going to rock and roll because that's what we do. And just try to get her caught up when she get there. So let's go. Countdown. All right, guys. It's a little cold this morning. I should have probably put on a heavier jacket, but... It's going to do what it's going to do today. I am on my regular 1000% high energy. Great, go in here and deliver all I got, right? All that I got. But I got to get my coffee first. Got to get my coffee first. Um, Because it's cold. And that's just, I don't know, sound like it would be nice to drink this morning. So, let's get headed to class and let's hope and pray. There ain't no accidents on the way. Okay? And just like that, guys, day one is over. Can I say, I never get out of class this early. Like, I left. It was probably like quarter after three. And, guys, I'm I'm trying to tell you. I don't know. I thought I, I got to do my live broadcast tonight. And I was going to do it anyway. But I thought I was going to be, like, super tired and drained. And I'm not, y'all. Oh, my God. Like, I'm not. And I got another class but one thing I can say is I thought I was going to be a little like I don't know down because so many of my, my ladies had to cancel because life was life in um, but it was it was super cool it was me and I only had two students guys this was like the smallest place I've ever had <laughs> but guess what it wasn't bad now I think if I was on tour I probably would have felt, felt the kind of way I don't know but um it wasn't bad. Like, it was, I really liked it because I was able to, um, I don't know, you just give, you're able to give them more. Like, really, I can't explain it. But it's, 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 it's a lot easier than spreading yourself across 10 people. Um, so, I, I really, I liked it, you know. I, I liked it. I feel good. I still feel high energy. I'm going to go ahead and do some last minute prep for tomorrow's class. And then I got to do some seat work. For um, like just check on my tickets because my assistants can't answer everything. Some stuff they don't know, especially with them being new and still in training. So I will do some seat work. But guys, I'm trying to tell you, I was going to wait to do my video, like any of my vlog and stuff, like for my other channel, like my refrigerator organization and my wall. I was going to wait just so I could get over these classes. But I think I'm gonna do something today. I don't know. I don't know but then I don't want to exhaust myself because I'm famous for that y'all I really am but another thing guys I don't know I'll be having these random moments of an acts of kindness because I was riding home well I was somewhere I don't know it just happened over like the last hour because it's only five o'clock but like somebody had went in one of the groups on Facebook asking for fabric or something guys and all I can say is they lit me up like it was so many people that um refer my name refer my company and of course they refer other companies like rightfully so like they should because they are um reputable companies as well but i was surprised at how many people came out for the girl and even the person the poster was like oh they showing out for you i was like i love them so i wasn't really going to do no more no more sales like no more fabric sales because some of you know some of you don't Right now, a lot of our fabric is in transition. The fabric came in, we had it processed, meaning it was cut, and then sent to our seamstress. And so she brought, I don't know, probably like five bales back, but I didn't want to get confused with like what's here, what's not here, what's sewn, what's not sewn. And I know a lot of people are waiting on these sewn panels. Like some of y'all didn't even wait. Some of y'all pre-purchased them, like went on here and ordered the whole boat to have them sewn before I even can put them on a website. But I'm gonna say big ups to y'all. Thank you very much. But I don't think I wanna wait. I think I just wanna go ahead and drop a sale because um, cause y'all do. I don't know, I just really appreciate y'all. And right now, because I got so much going on, 
I don't know what else to do because I got to go do this broadcast and I got to prep for tomorrow's class. Then I got to do some seat work, like handle some emails or whatever that requires my attention. And there's not really nothing else I could do right now, but I was going to wait for the drop because I told you guys, um, last week we were working on this affiliate program and like that's the stuff i'm talking about like i don't know if y'all not implementing that in your business y'all you you got to at the end of the day if you're gonna have people vouching for your businesses like that or vouching for the service that you provide because they they stand by it they deserve innocent they deserve a kickback i don't know that's just me y'all know i'm all on my monetized model i believe that we are beings here for a higher purpose and we're supposed to be compensated for because how else are we going to live the life we deserve by not being by not being compensated how are you going to get there if you want i want a house in bali how i'm gonna get it if i ain't getting paid for the services i do and the things i provide you know and getting paid my work so like somebody just doing you a mention guys that's the stuff i'm talking about like so many people be referring my stuff and people are in my affiliate program some people are but i think enough of you don't know about it so i have my young lady melody i love her she comes she she's like she just be on it um like really building it out but not only building it out because like we have the rewards program now on a website but like if there is no explainer page and things like that like i did make a video and put it in the in the group the other day like updating everybody that this is how you access your account blah blah, blah. but i just want to i want to do more i don't know i just want to um i don't know if i feel like you don't know about it or don't know the right way to do it you're not going to do it and at the end of the day it's not really to benefit me because y'all talk y'all referring myself anyway it's really to i'm trying to tell you if one per my affiliates the ones that really get paid off my classes some of them make four and four hundred and five hundred dollars per referral right that's a lot of money all you gotta do is tell somebody go over there to precious class and they book and they use your link and you ain't gotta wait for me to pay you because it's automated like that stuff add up you guys keep talking about a bag or y'all better get into this affiliate market and i'm trying to tell you is is really it's a real deal holy field right one of my coins alone is strictly affiliate marketing i don't do nothing really with it it's like i've, I've already created i've already created the process to make that work and it works right while i'm over here working on my business so at the end of the day you guys are out here y'all vouching for these companies i totally get it because you you love their products which is something you should do don't keep it to yourself but also look for some kickback and don't be afraid to ask for some kickback some people don't know right some people just don't know that that's something you're supposed to do sometimes you gotta teach these people but business etiquette at the end of the day i'm like that's free marketing like um where my, run me my money <laughs> So y'all can tell I feel good because I be going a thousand. And I gotta go live tonight, y'all. Oh, child, ain't no telling how I'm gonna show up. Ain't no telling how I'm gonna show up. But one thing I know I'm gonna do, I'm definitely gonna take me a a, a nap. Um, because I, I was able, I, no, I went to bed at a bad time. I went to bed like two something last night. But I really woke up like, I don't know, like refreshed. I woke up on time. I did my whole morning routine. I felt great. So tonight, I just want to make sure I don't want it to like, I don't want to keep going to bed late and if, you know, it catches up with me. So tonight, I want to make sure I'm in the bed at a decent time. I might end up going to bed directly after live and just being in bed, right? Just, I, I ain't gonna go to sleep because the brain don't shut off that early. But something about just being in the bed. Um, I want to be able to rest my body because I will be on my feet constantly for the next three days. So, you know, your girl a little old. <laughs> And the bunions, I'm trying to tell I ain't got bunions though, I was just playing. <laughs> but that's it guys, it's hot out here. I gotta get in the house. I know um, some of you guys probably, uh, that's new to the channel, probably watching this video like, Dang it. and some, somebody was in class today talking about it. Like all I keep hearing is, I, I'm on YouTube and all I keep hearing is, hey, it's so funny. Like, I don't know why I'm extra. I just am. I don't know. It's just, I don't know. It's just how I am. I just get excited because I just believe that my job is to make other people excited. And I know I'm very good at that. So, <laughs> come on, get all this smoke. <laughs> Guys, let me stop. Let me take my tail in the house and find something to do with myself for probably like the next hour or something. Oh, I was um, organizing. We just got two bales of fabric in, which was our red spandex guys that red spandex is so pretty i'm not even a lover of red 
but baby I'm, I'm one of my backdrops tomorrow is I don't think I never yes I did I did red black and gold um one of my backdrops tomorrow is red and it's like a double it's not a double it's a triple panel right I'm excited about it because this fabric is just gorgeous I'm just trying to tell you it's real pretty so <laughs> I couldn't really go get no no you know no clips to kind of add into this vlog while I was in class because guys when I'm in class I'm all the way there I be forgetting sometimes I'm supposed to go live and do behind the scenes I be forgetting especially if my team not there now since these classes are so small normally I have my whole product my video my video team they being there with the drones and all that but baby if it's a small class that ain't in the budget so <laughs> i didn't get that kind of footage today but again i still had an amazing time in class i'm looking to have an amazing time tomorrow i can't wait to do this flower canopy because like i just can't wait to do it i did like a little mock-up and it looked really pretty to me it really did and then this sailing class and boom your girl going to biloxi i need to i need a swim up ball i'm trying to tell you and i can't go nowhere further than that because i only got a day and a half right before my baby go back to his project so i'm like all right let's see what to do i got i got a day and a half okay cool let's make it work in a day and a half as long as i take to a swim up ball that's it um so that's it let me go in here okay guys guess what it is 12 o'clock y'all and i am about to shut it down and go to bed um i'm not even tired though like i'm still on a thousand i had an amazing posh cast tonight with my peeps uh i just finished packing orders i had a couple orders come through today just finished packing orders so that could be picked up while i'm gone for class tomorrow um i just packed a couple things for class and i'm just frustrated at this wall not frustrated i just can't wait till they get done y'all look at my progress so far don't mind my flowers that's for my drapery class but look at this y'all we did the bit the bit the uh, border this little piece right here i just was playing i had to get a visual see how it look i told y'all that's how i do things but um as soon as class is done, like this is one of, yeah, I gotta get this done. Gotta get that done. So I am going to be, it is quarter after 12 and I might need a cup of milk or something because I'm still on the thousand. I don't know why, but I am. But I'm excited for tomorrow's class. And guess what guys, it's another small class, but I'm still excited. I'm going to do one backdrop that I've never done in class because my classes always are super packed and I can't do a backdrop to that size. So since it's not, I'm going to really take this time to allow the students that's there to create even more massive designs. So I'm excited about tomorrow. Um, so that's it. I'm going to bed quarter after 12. I should be showered up and like in the bed bed. I like 12.45, which is still a decent time because tomorrow I'm going to get up early because there's a couple things that I have to pack. A couple more pieces of fabric because the backdrop's so big. I just don't feel like doing it right now. I don't feel like working because I just got finished packing the orders. Um, So I'm calling it a night to night, but we're going to see what tomorrow brings. So y'all see what my energy look like tomorrow. It's that go and get it. So guys, it is I don't even know what it is. I think it's Thursday. Head northeast on Buffington Road. It Continue is on Buffington Road and for two I miles. I am headed to class number two. And I'm excited. Head southeast toward Flat Shoals Road. Although today. In 300 feet, turn right, right onto Flat really? Shoals Road. Turn uh, right onto Flat Shoals Road. Although today does not have no sunshine. At least not yet. But I'm about to go ahead and get me, um, I'm not going to get a Coke soda. I'm going to get something, though, because I'm a little thirsty. And, oh, not to mention, I really came to get gas. Guys, can I say something real fast? Now, y'all know, y'all that know me, know me, I don't go nowhere. I, so, I'm not used to putting gas in my truck. I am not. Normally, my truck is sitting all the time. And if I happen to go somewhere, it's the weekend. And if it's the weekend, guess what? <laughs> my man... <laughs> He is normally driving. So it's either we driving his vehicle or mine, and he's the one that put the gas in. But what I wanted to say was, 
See how I just pulled up and I forgot I gotta get gas? That little girl, Kayla, taking her back and forth to work every day. Baby, I have been having to, I have been having to get gas at least twice a week. I'm not used to that. So I told her, I kindly told her. Y'all tell me if I'm wrong in the comments when y'all find when y'all finally see this video. I said she gonna give me some gas money. Cause she is now adding to an expense of mine that I didn't have before. And I'm like, that ain't gonna work. I'm taking you to work for you to make money, for you to spend on whatever you want. This is now part of your expense. <laughs> so I don't know. I think next week she's gonna start catching the bus. At least there. Cause she caught the bus like twice because I had to work. Um, and I couldn't take her. I, I had meet meeting her live or something. I couldn't take her. And it worked out just fine. She said she got to work in 30 minutes. Um, so I think that's what we're going to do. I don't know. Y'all got to keep watching to find out if that's what the conclusion we come to. But I think we is because I'm not used to getting this gas. I'm not. And I don't like it because it's cold outside. And normally, even if I do got to get gas, if, it, if, I, if I have to get gas, I've probably been ripping and running a little bit like on a shopping day. And she normally is the one to get it. So I don't want to. It's cold out there, y'all. But I gotta go get it, so let me go get it. Well, guys, another day, another dollar. I wasn't so lucky today to be able to get home at a decent time. I was supposed to go to the flower store to get a little bit more um, florals. I wasn't able to get them so i'm gonna just double up on what i have which i know is more than enough um but i just wanted to i don't know get more just to make sure it was nice and full but anyway it is six quarter after six my back is killing me i was nearly home when my daughter called because she had to catch the bus to work because i didn't um get out of class in time so the bus never came i don't know so i had to go grab her get her to work now i'm finally going home i'm going to bed today y'all i am not going that's how it's pretty house i am not going to i'm going to bed point blank period i'm going to take me an epsom salt bath soak my back and lay down with kitty until Doc get home. So, I do gotta get back up to go break down, not break down, but go get some of the equipment out the uh, venue. I couldn't get it, my, I got some of it back there, but I gotta wait for Doc because the rest of it is kinda heavy. So I will have to go back out later, unfortunately. But tomorrow is the flower class. I did put a little clip in here, um, the backdrops we did today, so y'all can kinda see what I did. And tomorrow's class is for um, a floral canopy. I'm excited about that. I'm excited about that. Um, so yeah, that's it. I'm going to go soak. And then I'm going to go back out, pick the rest of that stuff up. Have tomorrow's class. Have Saturday's ceiling class. And then, guys, I'm going to Biloxi. So I got to check the weather. I hope the weather is, you know, pool ready. Because I, need, I just need to be by the water. I do. I do, I do, I do, I do. I was gonna cut my hair out so I give me a nice steam and a nice wash, but if I'm going to the pool, I'm not, I'll wait. So we gonna see, I don't know. Hi right, guys, so here I am, day three, we're at the canopy class, and guess what? Yesterday, when we were leaving, um, uh my my young ladies helped me like pack up to kind of like break down and pack up um so i went ahead a lot there today and by the, when i got home well no well everything was in the truck and then when doc got home you know he unloaded the truck for me and i never checked to see what was loaded in the truck and we accidentally loaded the fabric for today so this is a part of all of the mishaps that go wrong but thankfully, that's why I kind of always tend to stay close to home. Um, I could run run there, grab that, because it's still right there in the tote, all packed up, and then just run back. 
um, but they are cutting flowers anyway, which may take a little while because it's a great deal of flowers. So hopefully by the time I come back, either they'll be wrapping up or close to wrapping up, meaning we didn't really skip a beat. So, um, yeah, that's that. Gotta go home and get this fabric. All righty then. <laughs> All right, guys, so guess what? We did good time uh, with today's class. You coming this way? Oh, okay. We got out at, um, we got out of class at 4.15. Really, really, really good time. And guess what, y'all? We made it to the fabric store. So we made it to the fabric store because for tomorrow's class, look at this. Oh my God, this is so pretty. I really only came, ain't this pretty? I really only came for some more chiffon because I was supposed to come yesterday, but I ran out of time. Uh, Cause I wasn't, we got out of class late. Um, but, oh my God, y'all, I gotta go. I can't talk because, and I know I'm not even gonna be able to play like regular wholesale prices and I'm just gonna have to pay retail, but it's okay because I like it. I like this, Gary, you like this. Oh my God, y'all gotta look, look, turn around. Dang. What? All right, I gotta go y'all because I only got a little bit of time and I'm not sure what I'm gonna find. I'm not sure what I gotta sew. I'm not sure what I gotta do, so. Let me spend my time wisely. All right. This is so pretty. I don't know what I would do with it, but I like it. Yay. Like um, the zebra. This is nice. Oh, oh that's like seven. Oh, I thought it's that. Ain't say that. It's cool, but it got that wrinkly look. I gotta get out of here and get this chiffon. So I got to sew it. It's not bad. Like you got a nice little pattern to it. It's like a beach dress. That is so pretty. Is it three? I'm trying to fix this three. But I got, I ain't got no more three inch on. Was it this? It was something I saw. I was like, man, oh, this will go with my gold velvet. It's got gold velvet? It was like a yellow, but this would bring it out. What did I put up on the table? I hope they didn't move it. Oh yeah, and I already make some new YouTube content, girl. Ah. I'm trying to tell ya. This is exciting. This is, man, it's kind of pale. Oh, it was like this. It was similar to this. That is so pretty. Please stop playing. It was something I was ready to get. Is this still chiffon? Mm -hmm. I don't think so. Yeah, it looks like it. This is like all gone, though. Yeah, it's stiff. I think that was what I was looking at over there. That would look so nice with this. This is going to be so pretty. It was that. What? That right there? It was this. Oh, but now that I saw this, I like this better. I'm going to stick with the feet. That would be for the, the face. You need to put it on the Oh, yeah, I gotta get a balance for that. Eight for my panel. What's in the why do you cut my chiffon like that? 
All right, guys. So I'm starving. I I couldn't I couldn't hold out no more. And I don't know why I'm starving because I did have lunch today. Like um, where am I at? I did have lunch today, but let me get get ahead of this traffic. Oh, look at my, look at my truck, y'all. This is ridiculous. Um, so I went to one of my favorite places on earth, but guess what? I did the impossible waffle again. So I am still within compliance earlier today for lunch. I had a piece of fish. So I got my waffle y'all impossible waffle rather. And let me make sure you put, they got cheese on it. Oh my God. They got cheese on it. I got my extra condiments so I don't taste the charcoal. And I'm going to go home. I just got reply back from the young lady for the venue. So we good to go for tomorrow. Um, I'm going to take a breather before I get into sewing. I do got to sew some panels. And... That's pretty much it. So I, I'm I'm glad it's a decent time, guys. It's it's not even six o'clock. It's quarter to six, and we are literally like five minutes away from home. So that's a really good time to be, um, you know, done. Even though the truck is packed up, I don't care. Like by the time Doc get off and get home, he'll unpack it for us. I'll go ahead and pack everything up for tomorrow. Cause thankfully it's not like a we don't need like a lot of um we don't need like a lot of equipment. So um so yeah. That's where we are. I'll see you guys in the morning when we going. Oh I might see you guys when I'm sewing some pants. But I'll see you guys when we headed to the um when we get to the venue. Never been to this venue and um, unfortunately I haven't I didn't find time to go and do a uh what you call it? A site visit because the day I was scheduled to do one, she left early. And that's the same day I went and did the other young lady site visit and her venue was too small. Um, but her ven the venue that I selected cost more, but at least it was bigger. The other one was just too impossible for the design I had in my head. So we're going to just see how this pan out. And we're just going to create what we create. And it's going to be a masterpiece no matter what because... I'm going to map out multiple designs. Because <laughs> that's what I did. Okay. It is Saturday. It's Saturday. It's Saturday. It's Saturday. And guess what, guys? This is my ceiling draping class today. I'm excited because I haven't done one of these in... I don't know. Maybe about two, three years. Can you turn it down? Huh? Can you turn it down? Thank you. in a long a very long time <clears throat> and one thing is um i'm just excited about it because i'm incorporating color like i do i'm sorry i can't just do the basic white although that is nine times out of ten what it require but we're gonna do a splash of color and just see how it turn out um not only am i excited about that but guess what i made it through my whole four days now guys i'm not gonna lie yesterday was rough not the class, because the class was fine. The class was cool. I actually had fun in the class. I really did. But by the time I was done, you know how you on, um, you're like in your element. So like, it's like a car accident. You know how a car accident first happened? You, you, you're so in the shock nature of it. You don't really realize that you tore up. That's kind of what it was like. But it wasn't that bad. I'm not going... I'm Because I ain't wishing no car accident on nobody. So it wasn't that bad. But it was like... While I was in the thing... I didn't realize how much pain I was in. Until I left. And when I left... When I left... We had to go to the, the uh, fabric shop. We did that. And then even at that moment... I still didn't realize how much pain I was in because I was heightened from I get excited when it comes to fabric I do sorry that may bore you guys but but no my my view is that's not gonna bore y'all that'll bore somebody to just stumble upon this video but my view is it's not gonna bore y'all because y'all we see each other so 
I was excited about that, so nothing really, I ain't feel anything. And I still had my patches on. I had my Lighter King patches on. So maybe they were working, I don't know. But then by the time I got home, baby, I went to go get out that car. I felt like hunchback of Notre Dame. I mean, I mean, I'm just saying. It was like... In half a mile. Use the left two lanes to turn left onto Georgia 85 North. All right. Y'all know I got to listen to Siri because even though I ain't even going that far, I don't know where I'm at. Well, I, I kind of do because this, 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 I've never been to this venue, but it's close to my old office. So I'm familiar with the area. Um, but use the left two lanes to turn left onto Georgia 85 North. Oh, that's over right here. I never thought that. Okay. All right. But anyway, um, yeah, so I wasn't in no pain. What you laughing at? Huh? What you laughing at? What are you doing? Nothing. What you laughing at? The song? What is that? It was just funny. No, tell me what it said. It was funny how he said somebody's name. Hmm. Okay. Mm. I'm gonna listen to them. What's the name of that song? Oh, and oh, I'm gonna listen to it. Okay, see what she laughed at. But anyway, um, I was fine then. But then when I was like all done, like done with the fabric thing, I was I was wore out, y'all. I was wore out. Like I felt my normal state when I leave a draping class. Like I was wore out. I was tired. My body hurt. So I didn't do anything. I didn't pass go and collect two hundred dollars. I didn't do nothing. I went straight home from the fabric shop, and I got in the bed. And guess what, guys? I still had my uniform. I was that dream. I went and laid down, but I was in my computer. I was trying to like do some seat work from things I probably missed while I was in class, and things that my assistants couldn't answer because they're still new. So certain things that they can't they can't handle. Baby, I fell asleep at that computer. I'm on the bed, on laid up on the pillows. Kayla was over there at her computer doing something. I don't know what you was doing yesterday. She ain't lot of land, y'all. No she was over there sitting on my uh, couch at her computer. I fell asleep. Guys, this is how far gone I was. I wasn't even asleep that long. I think I probably was asleep like, like an hour. This is how far gone I was. I was asleep. And then for some reason I woke up. Not like fully woke up, but I woke up. And Kayla was sitting on the couch or the chase, whatever it is, and made some noise and I almost jumped out my skin. <laughs> Cause she wasn't supposed to be there. I, for, I totally forgot she was over there. She scared the heck out of me. I was like, she, I, I can't explain. I can't explain. You Continue on Georgia 85 North for one and a half miles. You'd have had to be there to get it. So I think I slept. I can't remember what time we got home, but it was pretty early, honestly. It was maybe like 5.30, 6 o'clock, something like that. It was it was a decent time for us to have had a class and went to the fabric store. So let's just say if it was 6 o'clock, I probably slept to about 7.30, something like that. I don't know. I'm just estimating because it wasn't a long time. But then I, um, yeah, I kind of just laid there because my back was on fire. It was, it was on, the lot of cane patches wasn't doing nothing. And... Not to mention, I think because it was consecutive days. At first, it was only in my upper back. But yesterday, that sucker traveled down to my lower back and to my hips. Now, I normally... Now, I do have hip issues. <laughs> I do. But I really seldom have lower back pain. It felt like I was in the gym. It just, that, and honestly, that was just because I was moving muscles and moving things that I haven't moved. He need a muffler check. He's he blowing out all that black smoke. Oh my god. Um, so it really just was because I was just exercising muscles that I wasn't used to, honestly. I it don't feel like I strained anything. Don't feel like that. It's just like I was consecutively <laughs> moving things. It felt like I was in the gym. Um, but nonetheless, this is our last day, guys. And I'm excited because I'm always excited when I come to my draping classes, though, because there's always special people in my classes. There's always the ladies in my classes that I enjoy their their presence and even if I'm feeling bad when I go in there it ain't about me no more it's like I gotta figure it out for the next eight hours because <laughs> it's no longer about me and then when it's over then it, it, it goes back to you know it goes back to what the, the real deal holy feel is right but um 
I'm excited because these ladies been with me for for quite some time, and and it's gonna be more or less not like a structured class. It's more or less like catered to them, and then still teaching what I need to teach. But I like those elements because it's like, all right, what you need, what you need, what you need. All right, cool. Let's roll with it. Let's 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 see where you at. Let's get you past that. I don't know. I just like that better because it seems it's more like I'm I'm adding. Um, more value, more one-on-one, -on -one, more private time, even though it's still a group setting, but it's less, so more, the, the less meaning the more time spent with each individual, if that makes sense. I don't know. But I'm excited. You wanna know why I'm excited though? Because even after this class, guys, now I told y'all right now in this phase, and this we're just being totally transparent, my household is sacrificing time. Because everybody now is doing their own thing. Kayla working, going to school, Doc contract is three hours away. I'm the only silly, <laughs> silly rabbit in the house all day, right? <laughs> so, you know, we sacrificing that. So I was, you know. In a quarter mile. Turn right onto Valley Hill Road Southeast. Turn right, okay. So it's like, the moment we have a moment, we gotta go. I can't go home. I can't be here in Georgia because home is not home right now. Fabric everywhere. We got these household projects that's unfinished. I don't want to be there. I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't. Turn right onto Valley Hill Road Southeast. So we gotta go. So the closest place, is for me it ain't warm enough to quite be in the beach. And I don't really get in the beach like that anyway. That's seaweed. Continue for one and a half miles. Drop me a little nut. So the closest place that I can get some kind of enjoyment, ooh. Georgia, Picture Streets. Enjoyment is um, Biloxi. So Biloxi has the Hard Rock Cafe. I love that hotel. And I know I ain't going to the same spot I went to the other day. Cause this looks very familiar. Um, like very familiar. Like I was just here. So Biloxi, I love the Hard Rock Cafe. Beautiful hotel. They have shows. They have. It's just a beautiful ambiance, and they got a swim up ball, y'all. <laughs> ah! mm! It's hard to find one of them in the states, really. Like the real good ones, clearly, is international. But when you need a quick shink, that it ain't. You only got two days. It's gonna take us about four or five hours to get there. We can do that. Cause right after class, baby, we dropping, we dropping this trap. Hopping in the car, everything in the truck stand. I'll deal with it when I get back. And I gotta go. I, I gotta go. I gotta meditate. I gotta put my feet in some sand. Or I got, cause there's a beach there too. There's a beach. Um, I forgot what beach it is, close to Biloxi. But it's a beach there, and to just be able to be in the pool, the heated, the heated jacuzzi. Going. I'm just upset I ain't got that long. But I'm just grateful. I'm grateful that I get the two days I get. So that's what we all gonna do. Our little getaway, Kayla could use it too because Kayla been working her little butt off, y'all. They, they've been wearing my baby out. <laughs> they've been wearing my baby out. So we all we all need a quick little just rejuvenation. Doc needed, he on the road six hours every day. So we gonna see. And right now I'm talking to y'all so long, so I'm headed to the I'm headed to the venue. But I'm gonna go in here. I'm excited. Cause I haven't done ceiling draping in so long, and y'all see my ladder? Well, yeah, maybe y'all don't, but <laughs> there it is. I'm never excited to get on the ladder, but I'm gonna get on that sucker. So I'm gonna try to take some clips of like the, cause we're doing three different styles. At least that's the plan. I'm gonna try to take some clips of um, like each look, each look, and. I will see you guys in the next clip. So stay tuned. All right, guys. So guess what? The master class is over. Why we get put out? <laughs> Why I was contracted for nine to three, but I thought it was nine to four because all my classes are nine to four. But I know I'm. Um, but I knew we were going. Watch that oh, don't help at all. I did reach over there to help you. But but um uh it was it, I knew it was like a group thing. 
uh, what the, the assignment was a group assignment so we could have got it done and by you know by the, a lot of time but we ran into a couple difficulties you know we did we did but i still had a nice time um they some of my some of my most loyal tribe members like i love them ladies and my girl carla this is a fossil this is what she be catching when she go like white water rafting and stuff i thought that was super cool she gave all of us one and um i'm gonna paint mine gold and put it i'm gonna leave it right on my mantle right on the fireplace um i lost my earring <laughs> and my hair you guys my, i look like the class why would he do that i look exactly like um how the class went it just wore us out it wore us out that's one thing about ceiling draping ball up and down the ladder tussling with fabric arms raised for long periods of time but we made it do what it do and i'm glad we were like what is he doing at the point that we were at i must be trying to get in at the point where we were at sorry guys i'm in this gas station and they just driving all crazy I'm glad that we were at the point that we were at so because we were able to actually kind of like get get it finished before we got put out <laughs> we didn't get put out that was my fault i went beyond my time well we did get put out but again i went beyond my time because i didn't think i didn't think um that's why mm -mm -mm. and this is like i guess considered uh not so uh this is a rougher part of the town. I, you can just tell by the people that's in the gas station. <laughs> Why he, he just sitting there looking? Like I'm not trying to get out. <laughs> like this is really great business we are. Yeah. <laughs> 